Hello, it's Keith from Kinvert, and in this video we are going to be going over how to do a sweep. So first we need a profile and a path. Let's get on that. We're going to start with our profile. So I'm going to draw on the grid. I'm going to draw an ellipse like this. How about that? So there is the profile. Now I want a path. So what I'm going to do is put this cube here so that I can use the plane for the path. And I'm going to draw a, uh, I'll do a polyline. I'm going to draw it on this face. And I will start in the center and work up. And now when I do this next click, I'm going to click and hold so that I can make a curve. Is it working? Yes, it's working. So I'm going to click there, let go, click again and hold. And we're going to end up with this kind of curved path here. I can now delete the cube. And now it's time to do the actual sweep command. I'm going to go to Construct, Sweep. The profile is this closed profile. And the path is this. And now we've got our shape here. And so I'm actually going to even do a little bit more here. I'm going to turn this into a sort of a goofy vase. So I'm going to go to Modify, Hollow, or Shell. Going to make this one millimeter thick. How about two? And I'm going to click on this face, hit Enter. And now we've got ourselves this kind of goofy, curvy vase thing. All right, this was made with the sweep command. I want you to look and see how you could make other stuff with this. There's a lot of different stuff, a lot of different shapes that you could make with this type of command. I'm going to go ahead and do this. And I just want you to experiment with this and see what kind of cool stuff you can make. I'm going to make one more example here with sweep. No, 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 no. Try this again. Um, construct, sweep, this profile with this path. And so you can see that you can make all kinds of different shapes with this. So I want you to mess around with it, see what you can make. And yeah, there is a profile and a path. And it might be easiest from time to time to use a box so that you can get that plane upon which you can draw. So we went over how to do a construct sweep. This is Keith from Kinvert. I hope you found this helpful. And we will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.